All right, so I ain't did a baseball video in a minute. Um, the last one I did, I can't remember. I think I did my favorite picture or something, but I just wanted to look at the top 10 home run hitters. Um, I'm going to just say the number and what they got, my, uh, how many they got. Uh, so 1 to 10, uh, Barry Bonds is first with 762. This is all time. Um, uh, Harry Hank Aaron is a, a second with 755. Babe Ruth in third place with 714. Alex Rodriguez, fourth with 696. Uh, fifth, Willie Mays, 660. Sixth is uh, Albert Pujols with 656. Uh, King Griffey Jr., uh, Albert Pujols, uh, he active. He's the only active player in the top 10. Uh, King Griffey Jr. is seventh, my favorite player of all the time. 630, 630 uh, home runs. Then uh, Jim Tomei, remember him? Uh, he played for the Indians most of the time. So, uh, 612, test, uh, 612 home runs. He's eighth. Sammy Sosa, ninth with 609. And then Frank uh, Robinson, uh, let me make sure I said his name right. I know for sure. This is Frank, right? Because it's two Robinsons, I think this. Yeah, Frank Robinson put up 586 home runs. So, yeah, I think um, I'm just going to do those 10. Um, out of these 10, uh, Sosa only had 8,803 at-bats. Barry Bonds only had 9,847. So, basically, Aaron had over 12,000 bats at-bats. He's second. Uh, fourth, fifth, and sixth, A-Rod, Willie, Willie Mays, and... Um, Albert Pujols all had 10,000 at-bats. Um, but at-bats don't really uh, it count, but Bonds only had 9,847 because he got uh, he had 2,558 2, uh, BBs. That's walks. Yeah, I know this baseball stuff, man. Um, um, let's see. Uh, batting, the, R, the RBIs out of the top 10. The, the guys in the top 10 home runs. Uh, Pujols got over 2,000 RBIs. Alex Rodriguez, Babe Ruth. And uh, Harry Aaron. Uh, okay, still, I do care about stolen bases, but not in this argument. Uh, on base percentage. Out of the top 10, the, on, the, the only guys that's over 400 on base percentage is Jim Tomey, uh, Babe Ruth, and uh, Barry Bonds. Um, so they got an argument there. I'm trying to see who y'all think is the home run king. And then batting average, um, Bonds is at 298. Uh, okay, I'm just going through this real quick. Uh, Bonds, this is in order from how many home runs they got. Bonds is at batting, Bonds batted 298. Harry Aaron, uh, 3, 305. Babe Ruth batted 342 and still had 714 home runs. Um, well, I'm gonna do hits next. So, Alex Rodriguez batted 295. Willie Mays, 302. Albert Pujols, 300. Ken Griffey Jr., 284. Jim Tommy, 276. Sammy Sosa, 273. And then, um, Frank Robinson, 294. Then hits. Uh, Barry Bonds had 2,935. Uh, I'm going back to the top. Hank Aaron had 3,771 hits. So he was close to uh, a couple more seasons. He would have 4,000 with 755 home runs. And he batted over 300. That's why I don't. I think he's the best hitter uh, ever. Uh, Babe Ruth, uh, out of the home run hitters. Babe Ruth, 2,873. But he only had 8,399 at-bats because he played pitcher, too. Uh, Alex Rodriguez, 3,115 hits. Willie Mays, 3,283. Albert Pujols, 3,202. King Griffith Jr., 2,781. Jim Tomey, 2,328. Sosa, 2,408. And then uh, Frank Robinson, 2,943. Those are the 10 home run hitters and the other stats as far as hits, on base percentage, RBIs, batting average. So I think those four are like, very, very important. Um, so on base percentage is like... Um, like Barry Bonds, let's say Barry Bonds bat four times. Uh, the first time he strike out, that's 0 for 1. Second time he hit it, it's a grounder short and get out, that's 0 for 2. Third time he walked, now he 1 for 3 on his on base percentage, but not, uh, but he's uh, 0 for 3. I mean, 0 for 2 still. It don't count as an at bat, but it counts as the, um, on your on base percentage. So that's a 33. So if Bonds walk and then get out twice, like strike out and then get a hit a grounder or something. His on base percentage would be 33% because one out of three, 33.3. So, yeah, that's, so that's why it's important because walks, because they put walks in there. So, basically, you just add a walk as an at bat and a hit. That's how you do uh, on base percentage, but that's pretty easy. You know, everything else, batting average is easy. Bat three times, uh, you hit you hit and get uh, get safe the first uh, twice out of the three times. That's two for three. This batting average is easy to calculate. Hits, if you get on, if you get a hit, you, uh, you, Hits is easy to calculate. Basically, you get a hit and get on base. Uh, that's one for one, or that, that counts as a hit. But that's it, y'all.